Has the power to outwit their own fate. As long as the gods steer the ship of time, there's one thing that's certain. The chains of Satinav will not break. The days were happy for dreamy Andergast. Peace with arch enemy Nostria seemed to be within immediate reach. Nostria's queen was about to pay a visit. In order to prepare for the joyful occasion, the king had called the young lads of Andergast to take up a cheerful challenge. The oak leaf! He doesn't let go of the vicious dog! Dogs are much smarter than that, Ulfried. They roll on their backs when they know they've lost. How about it, Geron? Are you giving up? <coughs> <coughs> Give him some air for a bit so he can make himself heard. I will... What's that? I'm having trouble understanding you. I will prevail. No, Birdcatcher, you will lose. I'll explain the algebra to you. You'll have to find four copper oak leaves to win the contest. I, on the other hand, need four oak leaves made of brass. At the moment, you're just one oak leaf ahead of me, and given that Ulfried here will soon rid you of this oak leaf, you're at least one leaf short of victory. Or do you still think you can free yourself? My hammer! Never mind him. <coughs> Why don't you just give up, bird catcher? Oi! Keep your head down! <coughs> it's bad form to speak with a mouthful! Will you stop? Just imagine if the bad luck charmer wins and gets received by the king. Help me out here, Ulfried. What did the blind seer say back then, before he was burnt at the stake? That Geron is evil. I believe he said that Geron will bring us great misfortune. You have to consider the exact wording with prophecies, Ulfried. <coughs> what if Geron curses us? They say he's got a dark gift. Nonsense. <laughs> Perhaps I'll consider giving you a sip later on, as a consolation for your defeat. Far be it from me to stifle your hopes, Geron, but my jug is much too far away for you. <laughs> What the? Stop it! Do you want to bludgeon him to death? Just take the oak leaf and let's go. Yes, they were indeed happy days for dreamy Andergast. Only a few foresaw that soon nothing would be the same as it had been before. <laughs>